Well, here we go again. Another year of football to look forward to as the EFL season kicks off in less than 24 hours as Portsmouth FC welcome Luton Town to Fratton Park here on Saturday. It will be Portsmouth's second season back in League One and they will be looking to build on their ninth place finish last season, which despite being their first after promotion from League Two, they'll still be bitterly disappointed that they missed out on a playoff spot. And what better chance to get things started well than with a home game against Luton. Boss Kenny Jacket has described the atmosphere here at Portsmouth as special and crucial. With three of the opening four games, including cup competitions at home, Jacket is hoping that the atmosphere and the home fans can drive his team forward to the perfect start to the season. Now, before every season, you have your pre-season and your transfer window, and this one has been rather mixed for Portsmouth fans. When it comes to transfers, there haven't been much to talk about, with only Brown and Naylor moving to Fratton Park, whilst you do have Naysmith and Oxlade Chamberlain both leaving. However, all of these deals have been free transfers, meaning a lack of money both in and out of the club. And when it comes to your pre-season games, well, there are two positive results to look at for Portsmouth fans. A 1-1 draw against Brighton, albeit a weakened version of the Premier League side, and a 1-1 draw most recently at home here to Fratton Park against Eva de Vida side Utrecht, who are competing for Europa League qualification. Having those kind of results will certainly bolster Portsmouth of heading into a new season, knowing that they can hang with opposition much higher than them in terms of football tiers. Jacket has said that a good start is crucial if Portsmouth want to build on last season and get closer to that playoff and maybe even automatic promotion spots. Where we will be come May next year is anyone's guess, but for Portsmouth fans, they'll be hoping that maybe a return to the Championship is on the cards by then. Linus Harrington, That's TV.